As wildfires continue to rage across the Pacific Northwest, experts say it's also you should remember to check the air quality inside your home as well, even if you're not really anywhere close to the fires. Cap KVU's Ellie Nakamoto White talked to a local HVAC contractor about ways to keep you and your loved ones safe while inside. You want to protect your family. This is the simplest thing you can do to make sure everybody's breathing better with all the time they're spending inside. The air outside is filled with dust, smoke, and ash particles. But experts say that air quality inside is also important for your health. The Washington State Department of Health says that infants and children under the age of 18 are especially vulnerable because their lungs and airways are still developing and they breathe more air per pound of body weight than adults. Jeff Wambolt, the owner of local HVAC business Jacobs and Rhodes, says one easy way to keep your air quality inside clean is to change your air filter. Well, you may have to do it every couple of weeks with these wildfires. These are special circumstances. The World Health Organization says that both AAP and household air pollution contribute to respiratory tract infections that resulted in 543,000 deaths in children under five years in 2016. This stuff is really caustic um, to your lungs, so you really want to make sure you can combat it with um, good filtration in the house. Everybody's spending more time indoors. Wambolt says filters normally run between 10 to $40, but that this is a necessity in any home. Just don't scrimp, you know, spend that money, it's worth it. To check if your area is currently being affected by wildfire smoke, visit wasmoke.blogspot.com. For Cap KV Local News, I'm Ellie Nakamoto-White.